I'm Joseph Allen, and this is Jacksonville College. <laughs> Here at Jacksonville College, it's a small place, most times even smaller than most high schools, but everyone's accessible, even all the way to our president. How you doing, Dr. Smith? Hi there. This is the main hallway of the school. As we walk down, this is kind of where the president's office is, all the way to our VP, and even our dean of students. Here in the main hall, we also have the registrar where you'll also pay for your classes, ask any questions, or set anything up logistics-wise. This is the place you want to check out. You having a good day, Shayla? Say hi to prospective students. <laughs> I love Jacksonville College because so many times you get lost in big crowds. Here, don't get lost in the crowd. Most of the times, if you need a tutoring session, a lot of times it's the teachers actually giving the tutoring. What better person to prepare you for a class or a test than the teacher themselves? Here we have the admissions office where you'll make one of your first stops where you'll come if you're transferring with credits or if you're coming out from high school where you will come in we'll see your classes. It'll be one of the first stops you make. So let's go have a look and talk with Mr. Cummings right now. It's super important. Welcome to admissions at Jacksonville College. We're glad you're interested in, in us. We ask you to go to our website and fill out an application. There's no application fee. Submit it to us. We'll get communication started coming with you. And we'd love to have you as a part of our Jacksonville College Jaguar family. Thank you for that, Mr. Cummings. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Now let's go take a look at our next stop. Here we have the sub, we have the lounge where you can relax, play a little ping pong or chill a little bit with your friends and then we also have the cafeteria where you'll eat your daily meals. And so just a fun time to relax and enjoy yourself when you're not in class. Here we have in the Weatherby building, you have the Jag store where you can get tons of Jag souvenirs, Jag t-shirts to support the school spirit, as well as our financial aid office where you'll be getting a lot of those scholarships and stuff like that. It's very important. Be sure you take the time to fill those out. Let's have a look in here. Just a great little fun place if you want to get a mug, get a t-shirt, sport the school spirit. Maybe your mom or dad wants to grab something and take it home. School spirit right here at Jack's Store. Here we have the library where it's a great place to just get away if you want some peace and quiet and as well as to get tutored just down the hall it's a great place the library is going to be your friend as well as getting tutored trust me i've been here i've gone you're going to want it here we have today who's going to tell us a little bit about the library Would you please tell the students and the visitors today a little bit just about the library and what goes on here. Sure. Uh, this is Norman Library for Jacksonville College. Uh, we are very proud of our collection, mainly proud of our collection online. Um, if you are ever needing help with MLA formatting or citing any of your sources, please give me a call or email, Connie Greer. But we are very proud of the space we have to offer uh, for studying groups, for projects, programs, anything we can do to help you, we're here for you. Wow, man, isn't that amazing? And what a great time, I mean, especially with today's age, to be 
even you know come here and get some peace and quiet or even to get away and be online and still have the same accessibility and truthfully you know even more when you talk about the world library being in your hands today yes yes libraries have evolved they're not just books anymore so you're pretty much virtual probably 60 percent of the time as a college student when you're using our library resources so all of our you know scholarly articles credible sources they're going to be found through our databases through the school wow well thank you so much you're it's nice to see you today thank you yeah blessed day Well, Dr. Maya said, I just wanted to kind of let you introduce yourself and kind of talk to the students because JC, like you were saying, does something that's kind of unusual in terms of especially being with the online program because people come in here and get tutored. I got tutored many times myself coming in here and you whipped me into shape. And so why don't you tell them a little bit about what's unique even with the online perspective. Well, we have a student tutor online station where students can actually get tutored from their doors or from their homes or really anywhere that they can access the internet through uh, Google Meet and it's face-to-face -face tutoring anytime that they have any kind of trouble need tutoring it's open during the time that the uh, teaching and learning center is open and it's also available if uh, students want to make it a personal appointment and see so isn't that like really unique especially with today's time being more online focused and more online driven, a lot of times you're left to yourself to have to figure it out, but yet here it can be really different. Even when you're online, you're still getting that attention, you're still getting that online interaction and getting that help that you need. And that's that's a really cool unique thing. Yes, it's really, really special now that so many students are homebound and even on the campus so many students sometimes are getting quarantined uh, because of the coronavirus. So they're able to access face-to-face uh, -face tutoring right here with students and with professors. Wow. Well, thank you so much for talking to the students and kind of letting them know what goes on in here. It's good to see you today. Yeah, great to see you. God bless you. <laughs>now here we have the chapel. It's a Baptist school. That's what we're proud of. So here we have, like I said, our chapel services every week where we gather for worship, being led by student praise teams or great speakers that come in and tell us some great things from scripture and really draw us closer to God. Except, obviously, there's a lot more people in here, but also staying safe and social distancing at the same time. Here we have the music hallway for JC, and it's very dear to my heart having been a music graduate from here. And right now the choir is actually singing, so we're gonna go take a look at them. All right, what is going on everybody? Hey! hey. hey. Welcome! <laughs> Just bring in some new perspective students to have a look around and kind of get a look at the music department. And so I just want to talk with you, Mr. Decker. Come on, let's go over and see. Mr. Decker, of course, you are the choir director of the music department. In a lot of places, when you go to these big schools, you don't get the one-on-one -on -one attention as much. But here, for me, at least with my experience, I always enjoyed it because you get a one-on-one -on -one opportunity experience and you get a chance to get exposed to so many things like if you could say something quick to the students what was something you would say that sticks out about the music department here at JC I would say that uh, our intent and our goal is that this is the closest thing to a family experience that someone can have uh, we have kids that come from lots of different backgrounds some with with experience and some with none at all and yet they come together and we help each other and uh, we support each other and uh, and they make amazing Amazing progress in a very short period of time. Well, Mr. Decker, thank you for your thank time. Thank you. Appreciate Come you guys. visit us. Appreciate Come you guys me. letting us stay in here and seeing y'all. Y'all practice up. Good to see y'all. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Bye. the gym of Jacksonville College. We'll come and watch a lot of the old basketball games and even as you can see national champions also very capable of whatever sport we're playing in. So get a look at it and see if we got your sport that you enjoy and come on out and try for the team. It was really kind of scary coming here to be honest because I came from a very small school and everybody knew each other there. But it really did have that sense of family. I like this college because it's a Christian atmosphere. The one-on-one -on -one attention, not just being a number, you know, you don't get lost in the crowd. The close family dynamic, um, 
the size of the school kind of like means that everyone's really close and you make really good friends. It's how close we become to our students. So, yeah, she's gonna check it out. 